All right, let me get him dressed. Um, this is Vegas, for those that may not know who Vegas is. Um, <laughs> it might sound cuckoo bananas, but I was just thinking about me wanting to like, get my Reborns painted by other artists next year because I don't want to have to worry about running to try to find a rooter. And so I was thinking to myself how when I used to, when I didn't paint at all, how I used to buy the kit and have it sent to me first before I would get a, a custom done because I would want to see the kit. I used to just send it directly to the artist, but after a couple times of getting the baby and not liking the sculpt as much in person, um, I quickly <laughs> learn to order the kit and send it to myself first um and so that was with vinyl and uh, it just always works out better that way for me because sometimes these kits look so big um i know my christmas baby well one of my babies i didn't really necessarily buy it because it was Christmas, I bought it because it came available, but it around that time. Anyway, I don't think I'll get it at, at you know, by next week, of course. Um, and I, if I would have just looked at the pictures and didn't know much about the sculpt, I would have assumed that baby was so much bigger based off the pictures. I even tried to take pictures of my own because I actually have the same sculpt here. I tried to take pictures of my own to see <laughs> how they make it look like it's such a bigger baby, but I wasn't able to really do it with my with my uh in my pictures. So I said, "Dang." But I know what size that baby is. So I knew that when going into that. But just imagine spending thousands of dollars for a baby and then you get it and it's like three times smaller than what you thought it was. You know what I mean? I'm just trying to get y'all to get the most view. Okay. Um... Not, not, not a good, good feel. Vegas is, um, oh, and by the way, it's not that the artists try to do that. It's just that sometimes, depending on how you're taking a picture, where you're taking a picture, what it's up against, it just makes them look bigger. Or if sometimes when you're using your cell phone, a lot of people don't know, but it changes the shape of things like their head may be disoriented a little bit as far as the actual shape it may look a little bit more rounder than what it is or a little bit more rectangle than what it is it's you know that stuff throws stuff off too um and it can really throw off the whole look now i'm gonna get him he's wearing i'm gonna put him on this outfit so i was thinking of, at first i thought this I was thinking this was gonna match, but I think this one is closer, so I'm gonna go with this one. Um, because I, I wanted to keep him in something cuddly. I'm gonna go ahead and put him on his hat, even though I probably depending on how that shirt is made. I may have to take the hat back off, but I'm gonna go ahead and take that red hat off him. But yeah, um so it's it's kinda interesting. Um how it all works but it's really beneficial and then for me when I'm doing a private order for silicone I like for the customer to send the baby directly to me because every almost every time I tell people not to do not to play with the baby before they send it to me they almost always do um and they will say oh I didn't play with it I didn't this but when I get the baby the baby got all types of color from the clothes that they've put it on or 
sometimes they're just outright dirty um and you can tell that the doll been handled so um and not knowing what's been used on a doll and all that i mean you you do have to thoroughly clean it but why take the risk of having issues or making the artist go through so much trouble trying to you know make sure it cures so usually with silicone i like for them to come directly to me but i had been telling people to just get the doll at least that i could see the size of it and get a you know look what see what it looks like blank um so yeah i've done that lately but um oh well Ooh. but yeah i just feel like you know when you get to see them up close and personal you'll know if you want to invest the money in paying I just learned that if you do this 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 is what keeps it pulled down for the navel so now I think I'm, I'm so smart <laughs> um oh my gosh you look so cute and just or deeper in your head um, so yeah, there we go, there we go, there we go, it's crap over there, y'all know I always have stuff over, over there, it's not light outside of course, you know, it's like wee morning hours, so of course, it may look a little dark in here, but that's okay. Ugh, I just love it. I just love him, love, 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 love him. Yeah. So, I don't know when I'm going to get to Root Vegas. I not even put him on the schedule. Is that sad or what? But yeah, I'm really excited about... Seeing these new, these other babies come in and I'm excited about next year. I can't wait. I'm almost done with the rest of my orders for 2022, which is going to spill into 2023. Um, but when I'm done, I'm going to be free to paint and do whatever I want to do. And I hope that I am able to accomplish some of the things I have on my list. Um, and I hope you guys enjoy them when I, when I do it. Because I'm going to probably have a bit of babies up for sale next year. Because um, I'm going to be painting a lot because I want to explore a lot um, with skin tones. AA skin tones. I feel like I can paint uh, Caucasian and um, biracial decent enough right now. I mean, I can always improve on all the skin tones, but I really want to work on improving my AA skin tones. So I'm really excited about that. I'm going to start with my own personal baby. And in case I fail, <laughs> I don't have to feel like I wasted money on a kit. Where is your other? Oh, there it is. Huh. Yeah. So. Ooh, this is kind of big. Gee, what size is this? I know I got it for a bigger baby originally, but one of those things like brand just make the brand makes a difference because I think it's zero it is a zero to three month but I knew it looked almost like the old three to six month but 
I figured um, the baby that I was actually getting it for Orion to wear, but because it has the feet in and because he's a cuddle. I like the, the feet in things. I don't have to find socks and shoes and all that stuff sometimes, but I wanted this guy to be cuddly. So I decided I was gonna put it on him first. My babies, they all share outfits for the most part. Um, and it's pretty cool because they all fits, fit them different. And so it looks very different. It looked like they got a new outfit on them. I don't really care for this one him too much. I think it's a little too big for my taste. And I don't like that color on him. So this color really doesn't do him justice, actually. It actually makes him look more pale. So it's not his color. This is a hard color to pull off anyway. It really is. I mean, he looks okay in it but not my favorite color um i don't know this is not my favorite color not my favorite outfit on him either so i'll probably end up changing him i did like it it's crazy i did like him with just the diaper cover and the hat but I don't necessarily like him with this. It's just too big. It's like swimming on him. I'm not gonna keep it on him. I can tell you that it's 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 not gonna work. So I don't know what he's gonna wear, but it ain't gonna be this. So I probably will put this on my cuddle baby or Logan. See, he looks good with with that, but that, that yellow was too much. Yeah. I was talking to a dolly sis, and I was telling her how I like to see the baby's legs scrunched up, but I don't like for it to be a permanent fixture. Um, but I do like when they're a little scrunched. There you go. <laughs> nah. So, I don't know. I, like I said, I do like him with it, just this. But not so much. So, I'll take a picture for Instagram. And I'll see you guys later. Bye-bye.